Hi, in this video, we will learn the very basic syntax of Swift language. Comments. Comments are used to write a non-executable text in your code. Semicolons. In most of the programming language, semicolon is used to end a statement. But in Swift, even if you use a semicolon or you do not use a semicolon, it will not cause any error. White spaces. Swift 4 keeps a check on white spaces, especially if they are used with operators. Print. Print is the function to print any statement in your compiler. Now we will see a practical implementation of all these in our playground. The first line in this code is a comment. A comment is given by double slash. This is a single line comment. After that we can also write a comment in multiple lines. That is started by a single slash followed by a star or a asterisk followed by whatever comment you want to write in how many number of lines you want to write. After that followed by a asterisk and followed by a slash again. This complete is a multi-line comment. If we remove this then the complete code will become a comment and at the end we'll again need to write asterisk followed by slash. Now there will be no error and this all will become comment. But we don't want it to be a comment so we'll remove this and we'll put the comment above. After that in the print statement we have written print and then whatever we want to print inside the brackets. The string that we want to print should be inside the double quotes. Similarly we have not used any semicolon here so using or not using a semicolon will not cause any error as we have used semicolon in the below line and there is no error in this. Now we can use any number of white spaces between print and this bracket. So most of the time the white spaces are ignored by Swift language but when we use white space between the operands or the operators it will cause an error. Sim like where this is the declaration of a variable x is the variable name equals to is the operator 4 is any value then we have given a space between 4 and plus and then we have again given a space between plus and 5 so if we remove this space then it will cause an error because the number of spaces between the operands in both side of the operator is not equal so to remove this error we need to give equal spaces after and before the operator so now this will be removed similarly we have equal number of spaces in the below line so there is no error in this file this is the basic syntax of our swift language thank you